Michael, what's the message been to the players in training this week? Um, well, we got back to doing what we do really well. I thought we were excellent on Saturday. Um, kept the ball well, the shape of the team looked good. Um, so just reminding them of when, when we do what we want to do, that's, that's what it looks like on Saturday. So it's trying to get that as often as possible. I suppose about the consistency then as much as anything, it's just same again, please. Yeah, you win three 0 away from home. It would be nice if you go just do it again. Um, but the, the the detail behind it is things that we did well, as in getting overloads in wide areas where the first goal came from. Um, so doing sessions on that and just getting more clarity and can you do it? Can you do it? But teams obviously come to try and stop you. Um, but the resilience of the team as well, even in the last two or three minutes, people making blocks and getting out of the box as often as possible and getting out of Scott's way, not not defending deep. They're all the things that we work on and, and Saturday all came together nicely but Saturday's a, another game, another challenge. It, it doesn't always pan out the way you want it to. Three different scorers as well at Mansfield. Are the team now learning to score and create the chances without Luke Varney, do you feel? Well, I think you look at the last two games, We obviously we lost against Port Vale but I think we created a lot of chances. So a couple of weeks before that we were disappointed with chances created, not people, it wasn't centre forwards missing chances and but against Port Vale we created numerous chances, only scored one and gave up a couple of goals but Saturday we've had quite, a, you know, the keepers made a few good saves, we've got in behind, you know, Alex has got in in the first half for a one-on-one, -on -one. Alex has got in what should have been a penalty for a one-on-one, -on -one. so it was getting behind their back line a lot, so that, that, that was the more pleasing thing and the work done was we created a few more chances in the last couple of games. Cambridge, they had been on a five-game losing run away from home in all competitions. They ended that with a draw last time on the road. What do you make of them? Well, they've, they've been playing a three, similar to us, a lot this season. But um, obviously last week they went to a back four, played a diamond in the middle of the park and beat Plymouth, who were a, one of the better teams in the league. I've said it all along, I think they'll come good. And they are coming good at the minute. So it was a, a really, really good result against a back, a back three. So we're not quite sure what they'll do, but... It shows that they've got versatility in what they can do. They've got real good energy in the team. Um, so, yeah, we, we I think they're similar to us, similar to Port Vale, really. They're a team that probably struggled a little bit last year and probably surprised a few people. That's not disrespectful because I think we're exactly the same, that they're, they're doing better than what a lot of people would have thought um, last year. And when teams have got one or two formations and you're not entirely certain which way they're going to line up, how much more planning do you have to do off the back of that? It doesn't really change because we, we've got things that we do. So when we play against a back five, for example, we do certain things when we come against a back four. And if they have two centre forwards, we do something different to what if it's a 4-3-3 three, three, where they've only got one centre forward, but it's a back four. So there's, there's just tweak. The, the, the players should know the little tweaks that because we might think they're going to play a certain formation. You just, the, whistle, the whistle blows and you're like, oh, we've got that wrong. So the players have to know that straight away you can't get that information onto them they should that's our job to let them know that that happens and is that your call that that that, that those subtle changes are made or are they capable of sort of making that themselves well that, that they should know and obviously we, we we might have got it wrong so we draw up a team um when we get the team sheets in and we say lads this is how they'll play and sometimes you do get it wrong because they, they throw something on you so it's important that the players understand that when you do shout on oh we've got it wrong it's a a four and a diamond, for example, they should know what, OK, that means we do this and we tweak this. So It's difficult because it's ever-evolving, but that's, that's 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 why you train every day. Injuries and illness, um, how's Ben Toza, first of all? Yeah, Toza's fine. He, um, he trained he trained uh, Tuesday, um, so he, he, he's absolutely fine. There's no Chris I see, he's been ill. Um, so obviously there's a little bit going around at the minute. It, Russ wasn't in on Tuesday because he, he's been ill. So it's, we'll have to wait and see about Huss. Injury-wise, I think uh, Ruben's... All right. Um, Ruben's trained this week, so whether he's fit enough, we're not quite sure. We'll have to make a decision on that, other than that, as, as you were. I was going to ask about Ruben. I suppose the age that he is, he'll know his body. Does that help you sort of as, as a guide, or do you just go entirely on, on what you think and what Gav tells you? Well, it's not important what I think. I go off what the player and what the medical staff tell me. Um, being the age he is, Ruben, luckily he, he came off immediately. He felt something. <coughs> Excuse me. 
he felt something in his hamstring, wasn't quite right, but luckily he didn't pull it. So that, that that's that's an old, a younger player will probably try and play on and probably do more damage to it eventually. So um, you know, I'll, I'll listen to the player and the medical staff as regards to whether he's fit or not.